You know, every time I've come into one of these conferences, I've always had kind of something on my heart. And it's amazing to me how at each one of those conferences, Jesus has addressed whatever that was that was on my heart. It really provides an opportunity for us to be renewed in our relationship with the Lord and to really be given the power and the tools and the strength that we need uh, to go forward uh, into the world and be His disciples. It's one of the most beautiful, fruitful, and exciting weekends that, that I've ever experienced. If you're looking for something that would you know, jumpstart your faith or transform your heart or give you a, a fresh start in your following of God and living as a disciple, I can't recommend a better weekend than the Power of Purpose Conference. To be welcomed into this environment and to see the Holy Spirit as active as He is here is just amazing. You're going to find that the life that is really shared in this conference, oh, it really does refresh and it really does restore and it helps to bring back that love and that joy that comes from our vocation. For some people, this is just a huge retreat. You just get away and remind yourself, why am I a shepherd? How can I best serve my sheep? And renew the first love inside of you of just yeah, this is why I became a priest. I attended my first St. John Bosco conference in 2008, and there I encountered people who not only knew about Jesus, but who actually knew Jesus. Like when it comes to evangelization and catechesis, uh, the St. John Bosco Conference is one of the greatest gifts that the church has, that Franciscan University has, to, uh, for us as leaders to put ourselves in a position of possibility for God to move. All the speakers, they're so easy to understand. You know, they're all so impressive. But anybody can come. You don't have to have a degree in theology to come and learn and enjoy. The thing that really blows me away is when they point out the connections in the Bible that I've just totally missed. You know, the connections between the Old Testament and the New Testament and things that I might have read and just not seen. And there's always so many of those things. The best part of the Defending the Faith Conference is being with other people of faith, people that share your, your values, your views, and equipping each other to be able to move out into the, into the world. I feel like I just have learned a lot about the Catholic faith, and I feel more confident in like, answering questions and just feel more confident and able to say proudly that um, I'm a Catholic.